Is this your first competition for yourself? Um, nope, this is my third year doing Fitness Atlantic. And how did you get started in doing these? Um, I was a dancer when I was younger, and then I kind of took a break, had kids, and then I wanted to get back into some kind of um, fitness, so I thought this would be a good way to start. So before you before you had your kids, you were never into the whole fitness competitions? No. So for all of you at home who think that this isn't no, for you, not at all. it's never too late. So basically, what is a typical week like for you while you're training for this? How many hours a day do you work out and how many days do you spend? Um, well, I'm, I teach group exercise, so it's kind of hard. So I teach probably uh, four or five classes a week, but on top of that, I try to get my own, um, you know, four or five days of cardio and then weight training and then also routine practice. And so what's on your grocery list? Because we know that, you know, getting in shape is pretty much 70, 80% diet. So what would you say is on your grocery list? Um, getting ready for a show, it's definitely um, protein, veggies, usual starches, sweet potatoes, rice cakes, all the good stuff. And what's, what do you think is the hardest thing to overcome when you're getting ready for one of these shows? Is it cravings or, you know, finding the time? Um, I think the week of, it's just finding time, getting everything together, organizing, um, and definitely the cravings towards, you know, midweek, they get a little tough. Um, and so, are you in bikini or are you model? I'm doing fitness and, and fitness. figure. Sorry, I don't know the difference. <laughs> uh, I didn't know there are four. Are there four? There's fitness, bikini, and figure. Okay, all right. So, and model. So, yes, there are. All right, so when it comes to getting tan and picking out your outfits, um, what type of preparations does that require? Um, I guess you, when it comes to fitness, you just got to figure out what kind of theme you're doing and then you go from there, get a costume that kind of works with your theme. Um, and then figure, it's just your suit, so I don't really have to worry too much about the sportswear or the... What would, what would you tell the people at home who are trying to lose weight and they're not necessarily doing a competition? What is your number one tip for getting lean? Getting lean? Just try to keep it clean, but don't, um, you know, it's still you still want to have your treats when you, you know, want them here and there. What's a treat for you? Ice cream. <laughs> Definitely ice cream. Um, yeah, you just, you know, I try to eat clean most of the time, but if you want something, you know, definitely. What, what keeps you motivated to do these competitions? You said this is your third year. Um, well, I work with Kathy Savage Fitness, so it's just a good group. And, you know, each month just kind of see what's going on. And then also just as you get closer to show, it just definitely gets more motivating. And then friends. I have lots of friends that do it too, so we kind of all work together and keep each other going. All right. Well, thank you so much. Thank you.